This is the latest version of CAT scan imaging. This 128 slice CT scanner is a time saver and a brain saver. The stroke center within Gulf Coast Medical Center uses it to quickly diagnose stroke activity. It's all about speed and accuracy, and this will allow our radiologists to make the most accurate diagnosis in the fastest possible time, and time is of the essence with stroke. The scan takes seconds, it's interpreted within minutes, and in the hands of the medical team who will decide whether clot busting drugs would be of use. 60 minutes after the patient walks in through the door is the best timeline that, that we can give patients this, this clot buster medicines. These clot busters, or TPAs, can actually bring a stroke to a dead stop. The medication doesn't alter brain damage, but it keeps it from spreading. Patients who get the drug have less long-term disability, 12% recover completely. New data shows the use of clot busters has almost doubled. The study looked at the years between 2000 and 2011. Clot busters should be given within three hours of the stroke. The window is expanded to four and a half under some circumstances. Doctors feel the need for speed, understanding the earlier in the window, the better. We have a pharmacy that's waiting in the ER, waiting, the pharmacist is waiting to mix that medicine and administer the medicine very quickly if we need it. Patients can't be on blood thinners or have a condition that makes them likely to hemorrhage. Maybe the most critical factor, recognizing the stroke symptoms fast enough to race the clock. For Lean Memorial Health System, I'm Amy Osher.